Welcome back, everybody. Temperatures are sitting into the 80s out there this evening. A live look at Petro Nissan on the west side of Hattiesburg. 87 degrees currently at the moment. And as you can see, a beautiful sunny afternoon. Everybody's getting ready to head home. Traffic's starting to get a little heavy there on Highway 98. They're at the red light with Jackson Road. But otherwise, not a bad problem on the west side of town. Now we'll head up the road to Laurel where they're at 87 degrees at the moment. And notice the wind. Blowing nicely east southeast at 14 Old Glory flying proudly on the flagpole there this afternoon. 87 right now in Purvis. It's also 87 in Petal. A little warmer towards the south and west. 90 in Foxworth. Fastfield, you're at 89. And uh, Richston. 87 degrees. Now we've been experiencing dry weather here across South Mississippi all day. We saw uh, some clouds in the morning, but that since moved off towards the east. But look down into the Gulf of Mexico, south of Mobile. They've had some showers out there into the open waters of the Gulf. I wish we could get that or what they're getting in Memphis. Some showers and thunderstorms up there. But unfortunately, we're going to stay dry for the next several days. And for the rest of this evening, no rain is expected. Outside of a few clouds, we're going to be looking pretty good as temperatures fall back down into the 70s by 9 o'clock. Overnight lows tonight only going to dip down into the upper 60s. So it's going to be a little warmer tomorrow morning when you wake up. Upper 60s across the area to start off your day. We'll warm up into the 80s and eventually the low 90s as we go through lunchtime tomorrow. Highs right at 90 to 91 degrees. We'll see winds coming out of the north. Northeast, and for the most part, skies are going to be mostly sunny here for your Thursday. Looking ahead to the rest of the week and into your weekend, it's beautiful out there. Any outdoor plans you have, the weather will cooperate. 92 Friday, 92 Saturday, 93 on Sunday. Overnight lows are basically going to stay into the mid 60s for the next several days. But one thing that it's missing, rain chances. And unfortunately, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Notice we start to see some rain chances in North Mississippi as we go towards the end of the weekend and into early next week. But that system fades out before it ever reaches us here in the southeast part of the state. So we're looking dry as we go into next week. Maybe the tropics can help us out. Let's go ahead and take a look. We're watching three areas. One, Hurricane Nigel is moving out into the open waters. Another area coming off of Africa. And then there's this third area off the coast of the Carolinas. And unfortunately, none of these areas will offer any support to us in terms of rainfall. But they will watch this off the coast of the Carolinas. Hurricane Center is giving this a 40% chance of developing. And this could turn into a hybrid system as we go towards Friday and into Saturday. Look at all the heavy rain they're going to get. Man, that would be nice for us. But unfortunately, it stays way east of South Mississippi and it will be no impact to us whatsoever. So rain chances remain basically zero over the next seven to 10 days here across South Mississippi. Afternoon highs remain flat into the low 90s every single day. So if you're a lover of sunshine, this forecast is for you. But if you need rain, man, I'm going to tell you, we're going to have to do a lot more hunting. All right, Patrick, thanks. We'll possibly